have our warm lemon ginger water like every morning and I drink this while I read. What I have been reading, you guys wanted to hear more about my books. Right now I'm reading Unshakable by Tony Robbins. I didn't know if I was gonna be interested in it because it's like a, a finance book, but it's insane. Like it's really interesting. It almost makes you excited to like get everything in check and have more comfort around money, not worry as much and be more stable with it. And I've been trying to educate myself. Sometimes it's a lot to read in the morning, but that's okay. I definitely recommend this. I'm reading it pretty fast. It's not a super difficult read. are doing a smoothie like every morning um this is gonna be a green smoothie but i made the smoothie yesterday and i loved it so i had to show you guys the recipe in here we have some fresh papaya banana mango cucumber ginger spirulina this is my favorite spirulina brand i keep this in the refrigerator coconut cream ginger cucumber cinnamon and then we are going to add some coconut water and some regular water this is a smoothie for my sister and I, so it's like double the stuff. And then I like to use organic baby kale. Basically, whenever you buy lettuce that's fully grown, not baby lettuce, then it's like built up defensive against you getting the nutrients. But if you buy baby greens, they're more, more bioavailable. Let's, uh, let's blend this up. It looks like a hefty smoothie. <laughs> And then I made too much. So we are going to save this for my dad. Gonna add some coconut flakes. I'm doing this like fine shred coconut flakes, cacao nibs, and then these organic cacao chips from Trader Joe's. I really go all out with the, with the smoothie toppings. Add a straw. We are gonna drink our green smoothie while we do some work. I do wanna go out today and do some errands but also like enjoy myself um because whenever i leave the house i'm always like working or picking up stuff for work so i just want to like go and do some stuff that i've been wanting to do and i'll bring you guys along and i've also been listening to this podcast it's the school of greatness with gabby bernstein i don't think i've ever clicked on a podcast faster because i love the lewis house school of greatness and i love gabby bernstein so i know that this talk is going to be like amazing it's how to manifest your dreams replace negative beliefs and attract abundance all good things <laughs> but today we're just going to hang out i want to do more vlogs where it's like just you and I chilling. I don't want it to be super elaborate. I don't want it to be super like staged and posed and put together. I'd rather just bring my camera around and we hang out. I just took a shower, finished off with a cold shower. So got in there, it was warm. And then like the last 30 seconds to a minute of my shower, I do it cold. Um, but I wanted to try gua sha. I've done it a few times, um, but I found this video on TikTok and she basically shows you how to do it in the morning. So I'm gonna put some oil on my face. This is Rosehip Bio Regenerate Oil. Um, I don't usually put oil on my face in the morning. So we'll see how this works. We're gonna choose a different oil. Okay, I'm gonna use the Youth to the People Acai Prickly Pear Goji Oil. This is like my favorite oil. I need to buy a full size. I only get the travel size. This is your reminder to hydrate. Take a sip of your water. Okay, I did my gua sha. It honestly felt really nice. Um, I think I'd rather go and like have someone do it for me. All right, I'm going to go do my hair and makeup. This is my outfit, you guys see? I have on some Air Force Ones, some Levi's, this little cover up and a tank top. I'm a little bit frustrated because like, these are the only jeans that I have that like, I actually like the fit of. Right now, all of my other jeans, I just like feel suffocated in and like that's the worst feeling. I wanna get new jeans, but like I don't wanna pay like $30 for a cheap pair of jeans. I want to get like quality jeans that'll last a long time and that are like sustainable. Anyways, we're gonna read the passage for today in Journey to the Heart. 
it's just like a little daily meditation to um get you with your day get you you know good with your day this is a long one um, but it's called reward yourself and i'm just going to read you the end of it reward yourself often when you accomplish a particular task when you've gone through a grueling part of your healing process reward i'm going to send a picture of this passage to my dad my dad and i were like motivation accountability partners so i want to send him a picture of this so he can read through it because i think it's super powerful and we send each other stuff like that all the time like quotes books we exchange books videos inspirational videos yeah let's let's get going though let's get ready to go i have my protein shake we are bringing a protein shake lots of water because i don't want to have to buy a water while i'm out and we're transferring over to this camera um, we are going to turn on, we're going to listen to our podcast and drink our protein shake. This has banana, ice, protein powder, seeds for seed cycling, maca, and cinnamon in it, and Brazil nuts. show you what I got quick so I stopped and I grabbed my shampoo and conditioner for my hairdresser because I can't find it anywhere else except Amazon but I'm scared if I get it from Amazon then it's not gonna be the real thing so I have the maintain the main shampoo and conditioner from original mineral and then from the bulk food store I could definitely see myself doing more stuff from there but like as of right now I had a lot of stuff out but I got just some organic brown rice like a pound of organic brown rice and then I picked up my mom a Mother's Day gift. We have a charcoal orange CBD soap. I want to get her like she loves bubble baths and like bath soaks and stuff. Ooh, it smells good. But I want to get her more natural stuff. She uses like Bath and Body Works and I'm like, mm lots of chemicals in there um and then this like natural loofah because we don't like the plastic ones now i want to go to a plant shop because i saw a plant on their instagram that i really want um so i think we're gonna go do that I wanted a shark fin plant and I got a shark fin plant and I'm super excited. I made a little impromptu stop to the crystal shop. Okay, so I'm trying to balance my hormones and I got stones for creativity and fertility. So I'm gonna keep these with me wherever I go. I'm just gonna like hold on to them. And then I picked up two and it was crazy. I saw this stone and it was like by a piece of paper. And so I looked up the stone on the piece of paper and it wasn't the stone. And I was like, okay, that's not the name of the stone, but I feel really called to the stone. And then I saw this piece of paper and it was like stone of wealth, attracting abundance in all forms in the workplace, drawing new business and gradual expansion, um, agate agate green moss and i was like oh my god that's everything i need and then the lady was like those are the same thing and i was like oh my god and then i got an um opalite i need to get better educated on my crystals but look at how beautiful these babies are i'm obsessed okay i'm gonna be manifesting queen just living my life um but i think we need some lunch so we're gonna stop and we're gonna grab some lunch and i'm gonna take you with me we have our lunch in here is greens olive oil lemon juice avocado chickpeas cucumber tomato and carrot um and we're just vibing we're just chilling i feel like being out for too long really drains me like really like i'm getting like really tired of this but i still have to get groceries and i still have to go to sephora this is all right it would have been way better if i would have like made one at home and brought it but here we are i have to i have to go to sephora but i'm not bringing you guys in there because that's too stressful so I sh we'll go over what we got after um from sephora i'll show you everything i got youth to the people super berry hydrate and glow mask this is some of my favorite stuff in the world and then green clean makeup remover it's an oil cleanser and oil cleanser is a must i got some laura mercier setting powder i like to get the mini size because like it's just way easier to transport and i like barely go through it because i just use it under my eyes and then some happy hippie from lush i went to lush this is the only size they had um guys i don't know if you can tell but like my mood i am like not doing well i am I'm getting very tired of driving around. So we're gonna grab some coffee, go to the uh, grocery store, and then um, 
be done. All right, let's try our drink. It's very good. All right, cool. Grocery store and then we'll do a little grocery haul. I'm gonna drink my iced almond milk latte. We are home. I'm gonna show you guys what I got from the grocery store. We picked up some organic lemons, a papaya, some greens, some kale, tomato sauce, ginger tea, mushrooms, almond milk, some brown rice, zucchini, and coconut milk. All good stuff. But I need to get out of these jeans like 20 seconds ago. I'm so tired of wearing them. And put everything away. Right now, I am rocking a Led Zeppelin shirt and Calvin Klein underwear. Um, that's where I'm at right now. I'm so anxious from being out that long. I said I wanted to like talk more to you guys, so we're gonna talk. I have definitely, especially over the past year, have become someone who stays at home a lot because I work from home. Going out just like drains energy from me, honestly. And I think a big part of it is because like if I wanna go anywhere from my house, it's gonna be like, a 30 minute drive at least. Probably around 40 minutes if I wanna like get somewhere. So the amount of driving that it takes to like go somewhere is just getting to be a lot. But we're gonna move up soon. It's okay, we're gonna have our own space. I'm so excited to have my own apartment, have my own space, be able to film without like worrying that my mom or dad is gonna be in the shot or that I'm like annoying them. Cause I'm like, hey guys, can you like, for a second because I'm filming I like I feel bad and I want my own space where I can create and be excited about it We use our crystals if anyone knows how to like do crystals like I don't I don't really know what I'm doing with them I don't know. I'll, I'm very excited about these. Maybe I'll ask you guys on Instagram What do I do with them? Like how do I use them? How do I clean them? How do I what do I do? I think we're gonna do pizza for dinner. So a little bit more of um, what I eat other than that though We got our plant day in the life Guys, you can see the plant now in its full glory. My shark fin plant, what should we name it? Sharky? We are going for a little walk quick before dinner. The walk fit is some Nike shorts, some Nike socks, some Nike shoes. My Nike running shoes that I like don't use for running anymore because I don't run, really. And this crew neck sweatshirt. I'm posting a sponsored video on TikTok. And so I usually like to not bring my phone on walks, but because I want to be there to like answer all of the comments right away, I'm gonna bring it so like there's engagement. But yeah. If you are feeling anxious, I dare you to go outside and do a walk and see how you feel. Do you feel better? Were you anxious? Um, and I feel so much better being able to like move freely in the air. Guys, I'm just on some energy right now. <laughs> We are doing a quick um, Thrive Market haul because I got a box and I wanted to show you everything I got. I love Thrive, not sponsored. Ouch. I honestly don't remember what I got. We got lots of chocolate, chocolate covered hazelnuts and chocolate covered cashews. These are the best. Definitely recommend you guys go and get some now. Oh, I got a free Birch Blenders Paleo Blend. I will not be eating this because I have eggs, but I know my parents will. They get, they do like promotions where they get free gifts. I think I will be eating this though. This is cacao date syrup to put on your pancakes. Like I could do some like oat pancakes. Good stuff. Cacao nibs and coconut sugar. I got some garlic powder and more chocolate covered cashews. And then, what? Oh, bee pollen. I bought bee pollen. I was really confused. I was like, what is in here? Right, market. Good stuff, let's make some pizza. For dinner, we are doing some pizzas with the bands of chickpea crust and the Rayo's tomato basil sauce. This stuff is amazing. The ingredients on this are great. Um, and these crusts are vegan, gluten-free. We have our pizza, on this one we just have mushrooms, and on this one we have olives and onion. So basically, the directions say to like just put these pizzas right on the rack, so we're gonna try that. How are you gonna get them out? Add these to the thing. Scared. Okay Google, set a timer for 14 minutes. We have our pizza all cut. I have some greens. I sauteed some mushroom, onion, zucchini, and kale, and then steamed some veggies. To our greens, we're gonna add some balsamic vinegar and some olive oil. The Bragg olive oil is my favorite brand of olive oil. I don't know what it is about it. And then we mix it up in my bowl. 
plate type of thing. We are going to add some greens and then we'll grab some veggies of the mushroom and veggies and kale plus some of the steamed veggies. And then of course we have to have a pizza. We are going to do some of the olive one. I don't know. I like, I've been into olives recently, guys. I never thought I'd be into olive, but I am. Two pieces of the olives. We'll try it for you guys. See how it is. I feel like, yes. For some reason, like this pizza tonight is really, really good. Makes me happy, you know? We gotta get that, uh, that new girl going. As the weather gets nicer, I wanna like start eating outside again um, because that was like my most favorite part of last summer was eating outside and like watching Netflix on my iPad. But my sister and I, we started watching New Girl over again from the beginning. We're only on episode like four, but I forgot how funny it is. I forgot how amazing it is, so. Cheers. Watch New Girl with us. Not actually, I don't think I'm allowed to show that. This is the part of the night where everyone is asleep um, and I'm still up either answering emails, answering TikTok comments, or trying to plan my day tomorrow to get like the most out of my day. Um, I have to like time block each month. Like I have to put in how long I'm gonna work out for, how long it's gonna take me to eat breakfast, how long it's gonna take me to film this video, how long it's gonna take me to edit. Just took some vitamins. But what I like to do is I have this planner and I just write down everything that I'm going to need to do. And then on my Google calendar, either on my phone or my iPad, um, I'll plan it out. That's what I'm up to right now. I do have to go to bed though. I need, to, okay, we need to get to bed because like I've been staying up too late and I'm not getting adequate amount of sleep. And if I wanna balance my hormones, I need to be getting enough sleep. So right now, I'm just filling out my Google Calendar with um, everything I need to do tomorrow, but that I will be doing tomorrow. I really need to like stop checking social media before I go to bed. And now, to really just clear our head before we go to bed, we are going to do some journaling. And that's where we're gonna finish tonight. I'm just gonna do some journaling. I like to journal either about my day or what's on my mind. Um, I have a whole video on journaling. Hydrate yourself before you go to bed, do your skincare. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys like these like little day in the life type of things where I just kind of bring you around, let me know. Leave this video a like if you liked it and subscribe to see more videos from me. I'd love for you to join the fam. I'd love for you to uh, be a part of what we got going on. I'll link all my socials down below. So if you want to check me out on Instagram, TikTok, all of that, it'll be down there. I'm sending you all of my good energy. Peace out.